A Black so Man's Guide to Escape the Friend Zone, Top 5. What works in movies doesn't work movies, in real life. You think they work in real life. Number 5, over-pursuing. In most movies and TV shows, if the dude is over-pursuing, coming to the job, texting, always being around, at some point in the movie or TV show, the girl breaks down and she says, you know what, all of this pressure and over pursuing you 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 locked me down you did it because you were so persistent i want to go on a date with you in reality it don't work like that in reality this is what happens when you over pursue now this is you leaving her job and obviously she called the authorities on you and they chasing you with your bag of cookies flowers, and trinkets. Now, in real life, this is what a woman's going to do. She's going to call the police on your dumb ass, and they're going to do what they're supposed to do, which is tackle you and take you to jail. This is reality. And it doesn't stop there. If you're from L.A., the West Coast, where I'm from, you over pursuing, and this woman got friends or family, this is how it's going to go down. Hey, man. My little sister tell me you can't keep your motherfucking hands to yourself. No, man, I'm sorry, I didn't mean it. Nigga, you think my sister a hoe or something? No, think no. Think she a fucking toy? No, I think she pretty. Oh, man. Hey, fuck you, nigga. Hey, nigga, hey, get off me. Hey, leave him alone, nigga, fuck you, too, nigga. What, y'all want some of me? Man, yeah. What? I, I guess so. No, man, this is my fight. Okay. What, nigga? Oh, oh shit. Oh. Damn. I sworn I saw the light. A hand reaching out to me from the heavens. My mistake was his fist. Trust me, you don't want those problems. These cats out here that still can't walk down the street because they were over pursuing. Alright? Be in reality. Our right, number four. This one is crazy. In the movies, they always say, you know what? Opposites attract. Now, you're not going to always be in a space where you're 100% compatible with a woman and everything. But if you are totally opposite and you over here pursuing this woman in the movies, they say you guys are somehow going to be in a great space in a relationship. In reality, it turns toxic like this. Where well, you been since yesterday, knuckle? Oh, no. Slaying and dresses, making money. Got the brakes fixed on the car. That's what I've been doing. What you been doing? You been fucking around? Nope. Let me smell your dick. Girl, you better go on this bullshit. Nah, if you ain't been whoring around, you been all busy, busy, busy. Let me smell your dick. I can tell. Go on, you back. I ain't playing with you. Move! Knock your ass out. See? This shit smell good, though. See what? You probably washed it off. As entertaining as that was, you don't want your relationship to be like that. All right? Now, number three, you don't want to be overly emotional or try to get sympathy based on your emotions with women. In the movies, it works. You can just be crying, being overly emotional, by the end of the movie, you get that girl. In reality, oh, she's looking at you like a big simp. She ain't going to tell you that. She going to cry with you, but she ain't going to get with you. you, you you're kind of like this. I'd make a good husband, Jenny. You would, Forrest. But you won't marry me. You don't want to marry me. Why don't you love me, Jenny? I'm not a smart man, but I know what love is. Now, what's the difference between that and this? So I just left the restaurant after waiting 30 minutes for a day to show up, and apparently I got stood up. I don't know what to say. Like, I'm trying to do everything right to be a gentleman. I brought flowers. I've been consistent talking with this girl for two weeks, trying to get to know what she likes, what she doesn't like. 
I made plans. I picked the restaurant, the day and the time. You know, I've done everything to be just the kind of guy that would value somebody's time. Like, I just... I'm just looking for my person. I'm just looking for the one that... I guess is out there for me. I mean, I want to be somebody's husband someday. Father. This brother's clearly the black Forrest Gump and watching these movies, instead of pursuing Jenny, he's pursuing Janisha, thinking that she gonna come through and take them flowers. Instead, he's getting ghosted. So fellas, stop being overly emotional. These movies gonna send you down the wrong path. All right, number two. This is what a lot of brothers is doing. They're getting advice from old people. Very old people. I'm gonna make it quick. When you get advice, especially when it comes down to relationships, you want to go to folks that have counseled other people several times and have gotten results. Just because someone's old does not make them wise. Just because they've been together since World War II doesn't mean they love each other. It just means that they hung out for a long time. You know what? They couldn't go nowhere because there was nowhere to go. So you want to either go to a professional or somebody that has a reputation for counseling people and getting results. Just because they say, baby, you look good. You look great. I want you to have the woman of your dreams. And all you have to do is be yourself, baby. That sounds great. But in reality, it don't work. All right. Number one, the number one thing that you need to do that happens in movies but don't happen in real life are grand gestures in movies you do something a grand gesture and the woman says oh my god whoo i need you in my life in reality this is how it goes down Did this fool really propose at the mall by the Cinnabon? Not the Cinnabon. Come on, man. These grand gestures never work. They work in the movies, but in real life, they don't work. Fellas, please listen to what I'm telling you. You can get the girl of your dreams. You can get the life of your dreams. I have a special offer, 60% off of my course to get out the friend zone take advantage of it it's going to save you time you'll get that girl and you ain't going to look like a fool out here on these streets holla at your boy take advantage of this discount price today it's your life get that girl get it popping a black man's guide to get escape the friend zone let's make it happen